So coming to the concept of the unit, nursing care requires several measurements like measuring the patient's height, weight, body mass index, 24 hours fluid balance, his heart rate, blood pressure. So like that many readings are taken. Nurse take measurements of physical quantity and compares those values with a standard value. Now coming to definition of unit and measurement. So unit is defined as a conventional quantity used as a standard of measurement. So simply you can say quantity used for the measurement is defined as unit. And comparison of any physical quantity with its standard unit is called as measurement. For example, in this picture you can see the height of the four persons is compared using the units that is it may be foot or meters. The units are classified into two types fundamental units and the derived units. So the meaning of fundamental unit and fundamental quantity is so the physical quantities which are independent to each other are called fundamental quantities and the units which are independent to each other are called fundamental units. Otherwise, it can be defined as fundamental units are those units which can neither be derived from one another nor can they be further resolved into any other units. So, for example, here you can see the alphabets A, N, T. These three are alphabets. They are independent. Right? A is not derived from the N and N is not derived from the A and also T. So, all these three are independent, but when you see these three are combined to form ant means, so whatever units that are derived from the fundamental units, if you consider A, N and T as the fundamental, using the combination of these fundamental units, you can form other type of units. So, those are called as the derived units. So, this is the meaning of fundamental unit and derived unit. So, fundamental units are independent whereas derived units name itself indicates they are derived from the fundamental units. Coming to the proper definition of derived units. So, before that you should know what is derived quantity. The physical quantities which are derived from the fundamental quantities are called derived quantities and units which are derived from the fundamental units are called as the derived units. For example, velocity, acceleration, force, work. Coming to the example of derived units, for example, if you take velocity, velocity is expressed as meters per second. So, units of velocity are meters per second. When you see the unit of velocity, the First part that is meter is a fundamental unit of length whereas second is a fundamental unit of time. So you combined both the fundamental units to form a derived unit. So this is how you can differentiate fundamental units and derived units.